Okay, this is the main source. Then I'm using here uh, hose. This is the main hose where I take the water source. Then this is the gallon, 20 gallon, uh, 20 liters. Then I use a uh, hair tea. Then uh, check bulb or stopper so that you can control the water flowing over here and also here and this one I only close this area because if I will put here a quill and also here when this is the time I will open this one so that I can put water drinking here now this is the main mean water drinking from here going here then this one I ordered this in Shopee baka naman Shopee uh, then I use this one drinking cup this one then going here and here Hopefully by next month or next week we will already put this cage uh, additional quill. That's the time I will uh, change the method also. Uh, I will use here poset, poset like this going like that. Then the water drinking inside. And this is, um, I will show you how. PVC pipe, then I use elbow, then from down I use also T PVC. Then it will distribute the water going there and going here. This is a two cage for my quill breeder. Then how it's worth the water drinking for quill. Inside the cage I use gallon then I make a wall inside then this is the main idea guys if you open the faucet it will come out the water that's the time you will reduce the flowing of water uh, a little bit so that it will not flow outside it will not waste the water guys minimize only guys uh, every I think every 5 seconds it will come the water a little bit only it will go direct inside the bottle like that uh, every three days you need to clean this one inside you make inside like that or spam then put more water then the dirt it will come out and also here I also have same idea you see the water come out little bit only it will come going down the bottle inside and also the bottle I make a wall so that the quill they can drink only by putting inside the heads guys hopefully this video or this idea it will help many uh, quill racer or chicken racer so that they will not find difficult for uh, putting every every hours they will put uh, water same like this this is my baby quail uh, every four hours I'm putting water inside and also this one I have also uh, chicken this one for meat production it's called 45 days it will come 45 days that the time to slaughter already uh, if you ask me why my chicken there are different color yellow 
orange, green, and what do you call that? Green, yellow, orange, and yellow orange. Uh, because this one uh, I only buy to that uh, guy was selling outside that school. Then I make order to them uh, for 30 heads. I would, I want to try if this chicken will grow past. Hopefully this is already uh, for this to me. Uh, I see already they are already going bigger. Uh, okay, we will go back to our main topic guys. This one, the main, uh, the extension, I will put here also PVC going here. Then, I will put elbow and T so that it will distribute also the water over here. Uh, here, I will put faucet also and also there. Then, I already prepare this one. This one, I will put inside. You see? I make already a wall so that they can bring the water inside. I will put this one here. Then the poset it's still flowing here like that. Hopefully by next week guys I will upload another video. Uh, if you like my video please like and subscribe guys. Uh, don't forget to share uh, so that we can also share uh, good idea uh, DIY water drinking for our queen uh, if you are new to my channel please subscribe also to my channel it's a big help for me uh, and it's a big help for me and it's my pleasure to have you to subscribe my channel uh, I promise you uh, I will give more idea on how to make water drinking and feed for our queen bye bye and God bless you guys